right here and I'm doing an official review of the official PSP wired headset. I was able to mess with it for about a good day, maybe 24 hours. <coughs> a couple of games I was playing which was uh, Battlefield, I mean not Battlefield, Call of Duty Line Warfare 3 I was playing on Target 3 online and a couple of voice chats that I was doing. Right off the bat, man, these, these headsets right here, they're they're awesome. I think they work great. Right off the bat, they remind you a lot of the Xbox Live or the, the Xbox Live headset, which I really did enjoy when I used to have uh, online on that one. Uh, but the only thing I did not like was that it feels cheap. And, and I don't know, it just feels cheap and plastic. I don't know, it, it, I think it could have been better made I guess I could say but uh, overall it's really really light it's really comfortable on your head it has real good uh, foam right here for your ear it has ear padding it's real nice that means you can play long hours and it also has uh, a pad on the other side right here well when it's on your head it's not pressing it real tight that's a good thing about this thing it will hold really tight on your head you won't be getting headaches at the wrong place. The only reason why I did pick this up was because my headset, my Bluetooth headset, every time I have that on for a good couple hours of uh, gameplay, <laughs> it starts feeling sore around my ear because uh, the handle, the ear handle, which I didn't like. That's why I picked this up. Uh, this does have a, a volume control right here. Um, so you, either you want to lower the volume or, you know, in your headset. And it also has a mute button, which is real nice. Uh, it lights up red when you know it's on mute. I don't know if you can see that, which is real nice. Uh, the quality and the sound sounds really good. I mean, it sounds good, you know what I'm saying? There's no complaints about it. Uh, I asked my friends and uh, my homies I got on a PS3 how do I sound on it. They say it sounds normal, it sounds good, you know, it sounds clear, which is real good. Uh, the wire reaches about a good eight to nine feet, it reaches. You know, eight to nine feet, and the only downfall on it is that it connects directly to the PS3. Uh, it's not like Xbox Live or Xbox 360 where it connects to their controller, the bottom of the controller. I wish they made a headset that you'd be able to control right here on this, uh, what's it, on this 2.0 USB, I guess, I think what it's called, 2.5 or whatever. But that would be really nice if they could. Um, that's the only downfall in this that connects you straight to the PS3. So if you sit, if you sit real far from your PS3, it's not worth it. Just stick with the PS3 or get a wireless headset, like Sony wireless headset, or any other. But yeah, guys, this this I mean, I'm gonna give it a good eight, man. You know, the only thing I didn't like about it is that it feels cheap and it connects to the PS3. I will be returning this because I think I'd rather I prefer the PS3. Uh, but for $24.99, you can't beat it, you know what I'm saying? And anybody who has not picked up a headset, pick one up, god damn it. And Xbox 360 already comes with one free. Nintendo Wii also comes with... Oh, no, they don't come with anything. That's right. No sense of communication on Nintendo Wii's online. Because it's inferior. is the worst. So hopefully the Wii U can actually pick up the slack. And, uh, yeah. Communication is the key to winning, guys. That's what you're to know. Peace.